At some point in their lives, 20 million women and 10 million men in the U.S. have suffered from an eating disorder. I'm Dr. Kevin Brunston, a pediatric dentist and a participating dentist with Delta Dental. I'm here to talk about how eating disorders can affect your oral health. Eating disorders are serious emotional and physical problems that can have life-altering consequences. That's true for your oral health too. You may know someone who has had an eating disorder, such as anorexia nervosa, binge eating, or bulimia. While these disorders differ in many ways, one thing some of these disorders have in common is regurgitating, or throwing up, as a symptom. The regurgitated food comes up into your mouth along with stomach acid. Unfortunately, stomach acid is very damaging to our teeth. In fact, it's similar in strength to battery acid, Battery acid has a pH of 1, while stomach acid has a pH of 2. The lower the pH number, the higher the acidity. You wouldn't expose your teeth to battery acid, and you also wouldn't want to expose your teeth to stomach acid. The stomach acid works to dissolve your tooth enamel, the hard white surface that forms the outer covering. Unfortunately, once the enamel is gone, it's gone for good. We cannot get it back. Therefore, we want you to do everything possible to protect it. But what a person does after regurgitating can actually damage their teeth too. Most people want to get the taste out of their mouth so they brush their teeth. You might think that doing this would brush away the acid and have a protective effect. The problem is that the acid has already softened the outer shell of enamel. So you will be brushing away your tooth enamel. Instead, it would be better to rinse with plain water. This helps dilute the acid without removing the enamel, and you can brush at a later time. If you suffer from an eating disorder, know that there is help. Talk to a trusted family member or friend, and seek out counseling to help change your behavior. The Division of Family Health Services is a good place to start. And if you have tooth enamel loss, talk to your dentist he or she can recommend a highly concentrated fluoride available by prescription or a remineralizing toothpaste that can help. You can overcome an eating disorder and by taking good care of your oral health, you'll be well on your way to a lifetime of overall health. Until next time, thanks for watching.